Well, good afternoon and welcome to Litton RV, where today we're here in our marketing studio only one mile north of the Winnebago factory based right here in Forest City, Iowa. In today's video, we're going to cover all of the Winnebago quality advantages, some of those can't sees or the no sees behind the scenes of the quality of Winnebago Industries. Uh, we also want to welcome a very special guest today, Ryan Helgeson. Uh, Ryan is our district manager at Winnebago Industries, and he's going to be taking us through those quality advantages from Winnebago Industries as we go through this, a Winnebago adventure that we have here in our studio today uh, to touch on all of those quality advantages from Winnebago Industries. Uh, so let's wrap up with probably one of the richest parts, uh, experience and history, and what it means for testing facilities that Winnebago offers, uh, you know, with Winnebago uh, basically being founded back in 1958 you know we're, we're 63 years into this yeah and and so there's a there's a lot of rich history there and there's a lot of, of meaning behind that in terms of, of why Winnebago you know did survive you know the the Great Recession from 2008 to 2010 and and there's a lot of different reasons uh, it really provides that brand value but let's let's talk specifically about testing facilities and some things like that that yep. Winnebago offers yep so we'll have uh a lot of different testing stuff going on. Um, sometimes we, we as reps will get out and see some competitive stuff. And we may see things that we from from other vendors that other manufacturers uh, are using, and you know it could be a range that looks really cool, real real uh, residential looking, but uh, we we may already have tested that thing and it just didn't fit up to our standards. So uh, that's the importance of the testing is to is to make sure that you're getting a product that's going to you know be built to last and also be replaceable if if it doesn't last for you or breaks down. Um, so. That's what happens inside of our test lab, which we have specifically designed for those purposes. Is we're we're doing uh, we're doing dimensional testing in there, so we're doing the length, height, uh, weight, um, widths, and so on and so speak. We're also doing um, storage uh, capacities of the works. Uh, but inside of there, when we're doing things specifically, we'll relate to like uh, the e coating process. There, uh, we'll have a gravelometer in there that we're going to start throwing some gravel at just to see how the, the wear and tear of the different thicknesses of the plating processes. As an example of that, uh, we'll have water testing. So in addition to um, that, we'll have a water test where every motorhome basically goes through um, in, in our ship-out facility right before delivery uh, to make sure that uh, you know once it's inside of there, uh, we're not going to have issues with water or, or anything outside coming in such as snow or, or any, any leaves or whatever the case may be. So we want to keep everything out. We want to keep the elements outside. Uh, we have over 200 some uh, sprays in our water test. It, it does underneath the coach, sides, back, uh, the roof, uh, the front end of the coach, and like I mentioned, every one of those coaches goes through a water test. If we find out an issue, uh, we, we find an issue because we'll have people inside the coach kind of, you know, checking for leaks. Um, we'll go back to the drawing board and figure out where the problem is and try to get it resolved right there in the spot. Um, we bring the slide rooms in and out during that test as well. Um, drop test, we talked a little bit about that earlier with the superstructure, uh, but yeah, that is one of the testing things that we, uh, we offer. Um, on, on particularly not every model, obviously, but anytime we come out with a brand new model, new design, uh, we'll, we'll do the drop test. And uh, like I mentioned, we did have uh, we do have ship out. Ship out is the final inspection of every single one of our motorhomes. So once it gets to that point, we're about ready to deliver. We're going to do a final inspection on that coach um, and make sure that uh, you know it's leaving this facility and can deliver to the dealership um, to our to our customers and, uh, and and put it on the lot versus being sitting inside. Uh, a service bay to kind of finish the whole product uh, that, that should have been done for uh, at the at the, at the uh, manufacturing plant. So, and so each of those components of the quality story behind Winnebago Industries then rolls up into the overall brand value. And it sounds like a salesperson type of comment that Winnebago does have such strong brand value and resale value. Uh, I always like to look at it analytically. And if you take a look at just very simple book values as a percentage of original MSRP you will find that Winnebago Industries products have the consistent highest amount of percentage to original MSRP brand value down the road. So uh, a lot of what you pay for, you receive back on resale value. That's correct. It, Absolutely. It's, just, it's a great quality uh, brand story with Winnebago Industries. So Ryan Helgeson from Winnebago Industries, I want to thank you for joining us. Thank you, Ron. At Litson RV here in our marketing studio, uh, only one mile north of the Winnebago factory based right here in Forest City, Iowa.